keep him like this for a few days, maybe a week. Call ahead. Tell him we're on our way. As soon as we're clear. Desmond Miles. Your life has changed so much in so little time. Two months ago, you were pouring shots for bankers and celebrities. But now look at you. You're an assassin. One of us. One of the good guys. Isn't that nice? Men and women dedicated to protecting and preserving human life and liberty. Not like those Templars. Cold and calculating autocrats, drunk on power, obsessed with order, all that. We're doing our best to stop them. Yeah. Doing our best. But you remember all this, right? You remember the Animus, the machine we used to unravel genetic memories and relive the lives of our ancestors? First, you were Altair, a stoic 12th century assassin from the Holy Land. Then, you are Ezio Auditore, a wealthy Italian with charisma and a talent for revenge. So, what do you three have in common? That's right, the Apple of Eden. <laughs> That strange artifact left behind by those people. The ones who came before. You know the apple's power. You felt it for yourself. <laughs> oh, it's been fun, hasn't it, Desmond? But that's about to change. Your mind is fragmented and falling to pieces. And if you don't find a way to wake up, you may lose yourself forever. <laughs> Okay, I shut down the Animus monitoring system to free up a lot of memory, but even like this, it's still risky. Desmond will be fine. The partition worked, the Animus is stable, and his signs are good. For now. But this was built to recreate memories, not simulate entire cognitive processes. The Animus will do its part, and Desmond will do the rest. Welcome to the Matrix. <laughs> Essentially. Yeah, you know, this one traded. If the... you die in the Matrix, you die in reality. And change the whole white on black to black on white. What's happening? I can't, I can't move. I, I can't. Anyways, welcome no. to Resident Evil Mutations. As you can see, we're starting on the beach. Just like in the 3DS game. This one is weird. They're using some. I'm not as using some strange machine to look into some guy's memories about the virus outbreak or something. And they also made him look a little weird. Yeah. Compared to the game before. This is Hello? what I call the Desmond effect. He looks. He does. Per, he looks pretty normal in the first game. He kind of looks a little bit dopier in the second game. The third game, he looks a bit the same because it's around the same graphic engine. But then this one, he looks completely different. And then the next one, holy crap. Just walk right past me. 16? No, they didn't tell you my name. Oh, God damn it, I'm still in the Animus? What a shock you suffered out there. Rebecca, get me out of here. They can't help you, Desmond. You're a broken man. Your mind, it's... broken. Broken. I feel fine. So did I. Hey! <laughs> Look at me now! Let's talk, buddy. Walk with me. What is this place? It's nice, isn't it? We're in the guts of the Animus. The original test program. No memories here, just basic physics, weather simulations. Hello, world. You're lucky someone up there had the sense to plug you in here. It saved your life. Saved it from what? Right now, you should be sitting in a hospital ward, drooling and chewing on your tongue. For now, the Animus is keeping you intact. Keeping all your ancestors from collapsing into one big mess. But if you can't find a sync nexus, all those personalities will smash together. That won't be pretty. A sync nexus? I'm getting there. Hold on. There. That thing is your way out. 
You're screwing with me. Here's the problem. Your brain is hash. Too many ghosts in your head, too many voices. So how do you fix that? You claw your way back into the stored data, you find unfinished memories, and you crack them open. Finish what you started, until your ancestor has nothing left to show you. That is a sync nexus. And when you find it, the Animus can separate Desmond from Ezio and Altair and send you home. Back to your body. Otherwise an excuse to have another game. Because it happened to me. But my body... And, and other basis, it's an excuse now. to add on an expansion so set. Here. A word of warning? When you step through there, everything changes. Nothing feels normal. But you are still in control, and it's up to you to find your way out. Right. If you hurry, you might make it back in time for Lucy's funeral. What? Ah! Oh. I thought you knew. So, you know, I'm sorry. I'm just gonna... Lucy. What's the word I'm looking God. for? I'm so sorry. Wasn't me. Wasn't me. It was that voice. Juno. She took hold of me. She made me. Can do it? I don't know, it depends. Well, I wanna promote what that doing? Promote a uh, gun ball. I've only played uh one advertising. Advertising. I've only played one mission and it's like Tram Mega Man. I wanna say X series. Ubisoft presents Kingdom Hearts. You be hard. <laughs> Ubisoft Montreal, Ubisoft, and I still don't know where that is. Hennessy, Ubisoft Bucaris, Ubisoft America, Ubisoft Massive, Ubisoft Massive, Ubisoft Quebec. Ubisoft Singapore. Ubisoft everywhere. Just say that. Ubisoft Jap uh, Kyoto. Well, Ubisoft Tokyo. Ubisoft. I have been in Narnia a week now. Safe we're, we're done in with my that. spirits, but prepared for the worst. The men and women who have fed and sheltered me here also give me warning that the road to Masyaf is overrun by mercenaries and bandits, not native to this land. What this could mean. I dread to guess. When I, I first set out from Roma ten months ago, <laughs> I did so with a single purpose. To discover what our father did not. In a letter written the year before my birth, he makes mention of a library hidden beneath the stones of Masyaf Castle. A sanctum full of invaluable wisdom. So what will I find when I arrive there? Who will greet me? A host of eager Templars, as I fear most strongly. Or nothing but the whistling of a cold and lonely wind. Masyaf has not been home to the Assassins for almost 300 years now. Can we still claim it for our own? Are we welcome there? Ah, I am wary of this fight, Claudia. Not because I am tired, but because our struggle seems to move in one direction only towards chaos. Today, I have more questions than answers. This is why I've come so far. To find clarity. To find the wisdom left behind by the great Altair. So that I may better understand the purpose of our fight. And my place in it. anything happen to me, Claudia, should my skills fail me, or my ambition lead me astray, do not seek retribution or revenge in my memory, but fight to continue the search for truth, so that all may benefit. My story is one of many thousands, and the world will not suffer if it ends too soon. It's Keanu V. You know what's sad? Mm. He actually kind of does look like Beardy Keanu V.
Yeah, bullshit. Fine. It wasn't that long of a fall. It was long enough that he broke the wood. I like how they had that there as sort of like a tutorial. I'm just kind of like doing it. <laughs> I don't even remember for this. I think it was just like some sort of outfit. I think it was a uh, sword. Like the. I think it was an outfit and. Uh, like the mind sword. It was like a sword, an outfit, and like an area or something. Okay, well, that was stupidly easy. Next. Look at that tutorial. I'm beating the tutorial. Not sure if that's a good thing. I do like the HUD in this one because it's really like minimalistic. But then I really hate this. I really do not like it. Especially since sometimes it actually has to load. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm up here. But. I just find it funny that it's like, do 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 do, we're following each other. But the real question is, who is following who? <laughs> you saw him glitch out there, right? Yeah. So, where are you technically right now? Uh, Masaya. Place from the first game. What, is this the Assassin's Order castle? Yeah. Then again, you only ever saw that one room. I don't know. For whatever reason, I just feel like it shouldn't be snowing. It doesn't feel like a high enough mountain. What do you think? Oh, it is middle of winter. It doesn't really have to be. Uh... It could just be a snowstorm, if anything. I was not even aware of that, but sure. Thank you, game, for telling me that at any point. Oh, hello. Well, it says that uh, Messiah is serious. Yeah. So. Yeah. Be merciful, please. I am the, the working man with the family. Doing what kind of work? Digging mostly. It took me a year to find this like chamber. And for yeah, the yeah. past three months, I've been trying that to break into the store. You've not made much Completely progress. Completely different area. I have not made it in. This stone is harder than steel. No, Acker is like will. the desert area. The store is guarding objects more valuable than all the Mas gold Air in the world. Masayev is in the mountains. Ah, it's nowhere near the desert. Gemstones. 
There are keyholes here. Where are the keys? These Templars found one beneath the Ottoman okay. Sultan's palace. So it says that it As for the others, I suppose the so, little book will tell them. What book? The a journal of some kind. That so ugly captain carries it with like him wherever he goes. Go it home. Not possible. Find work with honest men. Oh, I would love to leave this place. But these men... Pretty they sure will you're talking about run. Syria, not Pack your tools. Say, yeah, but... Well, considering Masiyev is a completely made up. What's that? Find the Templar Academy. This, I really am getting annoyed at these full sinks already. We re went through a whole game of them, and I did not care to actually get most of them. After a while, it was just kind of, it was just kind of dumb. Uh, you know, Ezio, I had a aim for the fucking hay zag. It's like, I'd rather go The assassin must you. not get his hands on that book. When we reach Leandros, we will escort him out of the village. You stay behind and make sure we're not followed. I'm Templar Captain and retrieve the jerk. Oh, hello. Probably still following me though. Which is kind of annoying. At least I can still do that. You know, basically run up to a person and uh, immediately kill at least two of them. I like how a slow motion kicked them in the balls. I'm gonna try to be all a little bit kind of dark and edgy, but at the same time. Sort of not really. <clears throat> Yay for having these early on in the game. This makes me happy. What, um, bear tooth? Yep. I don't see why. Because they usually, like, Metroid Bane you here. Or I try to find you or just take away all your stuff. It makes you wonder if these are just reused assets from the first game, but higher res and like better detailed and made for the weather that you're in. Yeah. Because the first game, while it wasn't as good as the other ones due to how, like, everything worked... That's mostly because they expected it to be a single game. I don't think they really meant it to be a single game, but they kind of... It was the first game of its kind, like, kind of like a trial run. So it makes you wonder if, uh... Because the game itself had really good graphics for its time. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure exactly where they're going. They go. Yeah, they're going that way. <laughs> yeah, just keep following them. Why anyone carry on? Oh, I'm trying to figure out if they can actually smell in Moxie, but if this is just in the can. So far, I'm just getting a fucking 10 day forecast. None of you leave until the assassin Those is evils dead. are Do getting kind of annoying. I mean, the biggest thing that I see is bones. Honey, honey. And that did kind of annoy me about this game as well. Which is the like the graphics, but the eyes were just so awkward due to the lighting. 
that they just kind of were brighter than everything else and it made you look like a ghost half the time. Them. I am holding on. Thank you, game. I really can't, uh, not, not hold on. Okay, so it seems to be mixed. Some are saying yes, some are saying yes. They're saying that Syria is a mountain country and it's not the, uh, Arabian Peninsula where it is mostly desert. Die, you bastard! But, uh, this one person says that they don't know it specifically about Masiop. Well, you know, Syria. You know? <coughs> But in Nebunyam, you can take them out and just know what I'm saying that you gotta see. Oh. Uh, ow. Oh, there's a hundred spots. If someone posted, this is Mafia, and the Saturn Street, and this is Mafia, and we all die. Honestly, from the dogs of it, I would say no, but... He has Mossy off and real body. Right? Okay. So it's kind of really different from what we see in the game, right? I'm already at the carriage, but I can't do anything. Like, well, now I'm not at the carriage because I just got hit by that same thing, but. Oh! Ow. Where are you? So, you know, some people are saying, yes, it depends on where you are, but, uh, you know. Tell me how it is. We're in the mountains, and obviously the mountains can get colder. Yes, but from the pick oh, I just showed you, honestly, I really do want to agree and say, yeah. It doesn't seem to be really high up in You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, now I'm steering one of these things. Why? Oh, uh, ours is just probably a cinematic. Oh, uh, nope, I'm gonna have to ram him. Yep, I'm not gonna take it. Bam. Okay, let's gear up and boop. Get away from him, then gear it up and boop. Okay. And boop. I like how my carriage is not really suffering that much damage when I'm the one, basically. I just wrecked his carriage. Good. And... Boom, man. Bam. And I just looked it up myself, since you don't really seem to know how to look that kind of stuff up. Uh, Syria is a mountainous region, and it's not in a desert, as most people look at it. Yeah. That area you're looking at, I was like at the bottom of the mountain. Now in this region, it does snow in pretty much all the time. So, Masia, in and of itself, is that like the base of the mountain? So, no, Masia is the mountain. We call the town and stuff like that. That's just like the base of the mountain. This is kind of annoying because there's just a. Let's see if I need to get over here. Stay out of that stupid area that keeps like destroying my crap. How come I keep losing damage from that? It's kind of cool. See, I just lost damage from that. Well, I'm the one that did that. There. Jeez. You know, I don't see how that's a problem. Stop him! Stop him! Ezio is becoming an old mom. <laughs> uh, you have a dirty mind. <laughs> no fucking shit. <laughs> Not to take your eyes off this road for a moment. Do you understand me? Nothing gets through. Leandros! Dead! You know who well, the well. Look what crawled out of its hole to die. 
lies at death's door. You know, I always Finish find funny. The opening Bring cinematic. Or throw yourselves into the canyon. Locks with his left hand. Breaks. And the cover off for this game, who plays on the left hand. In the actual game, it's the right hand. <laughs> no, what's the stupid pulse thing? I just, I'm really curious. Kill these five guards from a haystack. Wow. That's really, like, kind of like a certain one. You see how, like, slowly you just, like, let them fall? Oh. Dude! Not fucking cool! Why? Right, stab him in the gut. Nothing more like you stab him in the fucking jump. I actually didn't. And he died stupidly quick. You know what? Do you have like any uh, medicine or something? What do you mean? No, he had a throwing knife, sulfur, and he had a ton of stuff on him, but nothing really important. Because that blow from the heartbreaking basically made him have to, uh. It's like wounded again. So easy. Now you must sit down and play the game all night long. Forever. Oh, well, that's two out of three that I was able to just walk up and kill. I do like the evil sense thing in this one, though. And dead. Don't claw. Hell, I got he's like, you look familiar. I'm like, step. How familiar? Why well, the hope I look up familiar? Could it be that you are every bit as deadly as the legends say? Or am I in charge of an army of drunks swinging sticks? Maybe a little bit right of both. Right this way, Ezio. Nowhere left to run now. Not for me, and not for you. Kill that dog. Cut him down! That's just this. Do I have medicine? Oh, of course not. Stop telling me, game. I don't have any. Do you have any? Yep. He did. Much better. Fine. Yeah. Why does this look just so funny? I don't know. But now I have uh, my acrobatic abilities are recovered. And I just broke his neck. Now oh, this is gonna be fun. I can actually do stuff again. I like to pan out to show that those guys had guns and they still cannot hit me. That's just hilarious. Can I climb up from this side? Why so, not? do you wanna know what I wanna know about Gunvolt though? Does he gain the powers like Mega Man does, or...? I don't know, he only played like one stage. You're gonna find out later. Oh, hey! 
kind of just made that stupid. <laughs> I'm just kind of. Whee! What does it take to kill you, Ed? Why will you not die? Do I made it stupid or? Uh, no, he just threw a guard at me. Stop howling. And I uh, completely missed. That sounds so fucking stupid. I don't know why I just killed somebody. Fucking murderer. Well, the old hound. Everyone, Brian is a murderer. Stay away from him. You carry. Where is it? I'll fuck your shit up. Nicolo Don't worry, Brian. This will do you no good. Not now. We have found one of the Masyaf keys already, and are closing in on the rest. What is in that library is not for you, not for the Templars. <sighs> you can have our no the books, Ezio. There we go. We only want guidance. We only want directions to the location of the Grand Temple. <sighs> Grand Temple? Tell me more, now. Requiescat in pace, bastardo. I got they didn't bother translating uh, rest in peace like they normally always do. What, requiescat in pace? Yeah, they just send it on there without the translation. I don't care about the full sinks. You should, the game wants you to. This apple, it is a remarkable piece of work. Feel the material, hard as steel, but very light. You really want to be fooling with that thing? I do. I absolutely do. I have been waiting a long time to get my hands on one of these. Okay, you're making me nervous, Bill. Don't be. I don't think I have the right genes to properly wield it. Oh, but Desmond, you think he does? What the hell just happened? You were snooping, wandering outside the Desmond partition. So once the Animus located you, it pulled you back here. It's just following orders. Like a... A fail-safe program. Trying to keep your poor head intact. Whether you like it or not. What are you doing here exactly? Playing. Learning. Waiting. A lot of waiting. I keep the Animus distracted as best I can. For you, so you can explore. Otherwise it might hunt you down like a little virus and, uh, delete you. Well... My guardian angel. There's no such thing. Yeah, I... Thanks. This sequence too!